So we're now going to look a little bit at the three types of dietary molecules. Now broadly, we have carbohydrates, we have fats, and we have proteins. Carbohydrates are formed of different types and also quantities of sugar units. Glucose is the body's main source of energy typically. It is a simple sugar and glucose joins up together to create big, big, big units and ultimately then we could start to think about starch which is basically just a huge, huge, huge structure. Starch can contain roughly about 500 glucose units stuck together. Think back to that analogy of Lego. Starch is the Lego block, the individual pieces are glucose. There are other types of simple and single sugars as well, such as fructose, which we find in fruits. It's also important to consider the other more complex carbohydrates, one of which is cellulose. Now cellulose is a very complex long chain carbohydrate that we get from, from plants. Cellulose is ultimately also just known as fiber. So when we talk about the indigestible fiber that we get from plants, from you know, various different plants that we eat and ingest, the cellulose is what helps to drag everything out of the digestive system and it helps therefore to ensure that bowel motions are regular and also fluid. When the body absorbs glucose, if that has been broken down from something like starch or if somebody has just eaten simple sugars, that will cause the insulin levels to go up because the body will need to lower those blood glucose levels. And what we want are foods that slowly have an effect on blood sugar levels rather than foods that suddenly spike the blood sugar levels, which can be very detrimental for our overall health. So we want more complex carbohydrates that more slowly release their energy. So think about somebody eating, for example, porridge first thing in the morning. Oats will slowly release their energy content rather than having a quick burst of energy that you would get by drinking or eating something with refined sugars. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe below so you don't miss any future content. To learn more about CNM or its courses, head to www.naturopathy-uk.com.